Well, I'm here a little experiment going on with the PEX pipe. Um, this is PEX B and this is PEX A. They say they're they're made a little differently and uh, I'm going to find out. I took this one, I, it's PEX B and I bent it back just twice and that PEX A I bent back about a dozen times. I used that in the last video actually. But I have a heat gun here. I'm just going to fire this up and I had done this about ten years ago with the Wurzboro and uh, I haven't done it since. So I'm going to throw the heat gun on here and see what it does to this PEX B then I'm going to do the PEX A. It should only take a minute. I apologize for the noise. As you can see, it's, uh, it has a pretty good kink in it, although it only did uh, bend it twice. I just want to see if it has a memory like the Pax A does. Pax A is simply amazing. And it is coming back. It's actually pretty good. That kink came out a lot better than what I thought it was going to. We'll just let that cool down there. Now this is the, the Pex A and uh, Wurzboro and Reha are the only two products that I've come across that I actually say pre Pex A. This one I bent probably a dozen times back and forth. That one I only bent back twice. If I did that one a dozen times it would, it would have uh, snapped in half. So we'll see what happens. This stuff here is pretty slick. You'll see the process that takes place and when you're looking at it, it's like looking through glass. Starting to get clear there.
simply amazing how that happens. And I think this, I would say, a dozen times. Matter of fact, I'll check on my old video and I'll throw a tag in there just to say how many times I did bend it back and forth in the previous video. And you can see the difference. It's pretty amazing. As it cools down, <clears throat> it'll change back to uh, the white color. That one's a, a little warm, but it's not too bad. I'm just going to try, I'm going to bend this again just to see if anything happens to it. We'll just set that down there. It's still pretty soft. It is warm, but it's not really screeching hot. It's a whole lot easier to bend than it was uh, than it was easier earlier. But here's what happens if I do bend this pex uh, big about a dozen times. There you go. That's the difference between pex A and pex B. Pex B will break. And the other thing I mentioned in the other previous video is that uh, PEX A, the Rehound Wurzbro, you can use it in your garage and if it's below freezing you don't have to worry about it uh, splitting or whatever. You can see there that it's going back to its original color. It's still fairly warm. I have another piece of PEX right here. And I'll just bend this about a dozen times to see what happens. Two, 23, 24, 25. There's 25 times and uh, still nothing. So it's pretty amazing the difference between the A and the B. But that's just a little, a little demonstration that I thought I'd show. And there it is going back to its original color. color. This is Vega. It has, with this coating on, it has a six month UV protection on and this has 15 days so if you are using this type of pipe for us bro you should put some insulation on it if you're near any uh, fluorescent lights or near the sun anyway have a great day